Are you struggling to fix your AdSense ads.txt issue? Well, you're in the right place. In this quick tutorial, we'll show you how to simplify your monetization strategy and boost your ad revenue by learning how to add ads.txt file to WordPress or any kind of website. This guide will help you optimize your AdSense earnings and avoid common mistakes. So, let's dive in and fix your ads.txt file together. First, you have to go to your AdSense dashboard. You will see this warning message if you do not set the ads.txt file correctly. Also, you see a button to download the ads.txt file, click it and download the file. If you have a WordPress or any other type of website, this method will work for you. You don't have any WordPress plugin to set this. Now you have to go to the root directory of your web hosting panel. Most of the hosting providers have panel as the web hosting panel. If you host your website on a dedicated server or VPS, you need to get access to the server file system. You can use FileZilla like SFTP client to do that. Watch this video if you don't know how to do that. In this example, I use CyberPanel, which is most like cPanel. So navigate to your file manager in cPanel, which is dedicated to your website. Then you have to go to the public folder, which has the main public files of your website. After that, upload the downloaded ads.txt file here. You can verify the ads.txt file was installed correctly by entering the following URL in your browser. You can get this URL from the article in the video description. If you do this process correctly, you will get a message similar to this that will contain your public ad ID. I hope you got some ideas from this quick tutorial. If you have any issues with this process, open a question on your tech forum. Thank you for watching.